Are you looking for the best data entry jobs online that actually pay? Then this video is for you. My name is Michael and I have tested hundreds of different free ways to make some extra money online and many viewers have asked me about an updated video that shows the best data entry platforms so you can easily find some great options to make money online like this. So before we go over the options I want to show you where you can join for free and start earning by doing data entry tasks very easily and I will show you seven different options but first let's just talk a little bit about the basic idea of data entry and how much you can earn. I will leave also timestamps below so if you already know about that and just want to go to the list you can just jump forward by using those but overall data entry can be a lot of different tasks in general it's tasks that does not necessarily require specific skills or a background and education but of course you need to have an overview because often it's where you need to you know, type something or tag something or do different things like that online. So in that sense, it does require you to definitely have an overview and depending on the jobs, some of them are very easy to get started with. Some of them do require a little bit of training, but it is training that you can get if you choose to do it, depending on the options you want to. And of course, if it requires training, the earning potential is also higher. Most data entry jobs is something where you should expect to earn some extra money on the side. But if you become good at it and specialize in certain types of jobs, you can potentially even earn a full-time income in some countries by doing data entry work. And some of the options I will show you here, you can also take it to that level if you are serious and you can use just one of the options or all of them to get access to more jobs. That really depends on your personal preferences. But I, as mentioned, will show you seven different options so you can just choose the options that fit for you. It's not a prioritized list because exactly which one is the best depends on what type of jobs and what type of data entry jobs you prefer. So let's just get to the list and then you can get an overview and choose yourself which options you want to use. So when we talk about data entry jobs, we need to talk about Amazon Mechanical Turk. It is a platform that has Amazon behind it, so it is a legit platform. You can do all kinds of small tasks. You can in theory sign up from more or less all countries, but they do have kind of a strange application process in the sense that you do not really know who they will accept and who they will not, and you do not really get a reply for that. So that's just something to be aware of. But in case you try it and you cannot join, then just use some of the other options on this list instead. But the type of jobs you can find is, for example, as you can see, tagging objects found in an image to improve search and advertising there, or select back pictures or audit um, images or classify different objects you know there's a lot of these different options you can see this is just examples of different data entry tasks so they have a lot of jobs so if you become a member you can find a lot of work it will not pay a huge amount and cannot build up to a full-time income but if you are active and you can become a member it definitely can be a way to start earning some extra money very fast the next option is called Timebox, which is a little bit unusual compared to many of the others because it's actually a get paid to site where you can also earn by, for example, playing games and taking service, taking paid offers. But it also sometimes have different data into tasks in its task section and it has quite a lot and it also pays decent. It can be a way to earn a bit extra on the side. I would say if you decide to join Timebox, you should make sure to also use some of the other earning options it has because it does not have that many data into tasks, but the ones it has has are usually quite fast and easy to do and if you combine it with the other earning options then you can very easily actually reach a payout threshold that is ten dollars and then you can get paid out in cash or crypto the next option is called humanatic and this is a platform where you need to review calls so different companies works with humanatic and then if you decide to join, you will get access to a list of these different calls that you need to review and tag them and do different tasks depending on the exact task that company have asked for. So you need to sit there and listen and then do these different data tasks that you are asked to do. Just be aware that you need a PayPal account to be able to even apply to join Humanatic. So even though you can join from more or less all countries, it does not make sense because first of all, you do need a PayPal account to be able to even apply and you can also only get paid via PayPal. So 
if you live in a country where PayPal is not an option, you cannot just from an attic, then you have to use some of the other options instead. Just be aware that the maximum you can earn according to the information they have themselves is around four and a half dollars per hour. If you think that's okay, but that's if you actually build it up to that, that requires you to be very good. And if you think that's okay, then it can be an option where you can find plenty of work, but as you can see, it will not give huge earnings. It can also, in my personal opinion, be a little bit like tiresome work, but no, it can be great to combine because you can also just do whatever you want here and then join some of the other platforms to other type of tasks so it does not become so boring. Next platform is called Scribe, and this is a transcription platform. So you can see some of the tasks they offer for their clients is transcription, audio, transcription of podcast, and video transcription more. So if you are good at transcribing, you know that might require some training uh, to do, or you need to be very good at languages and of writing. And if you are, then it can definitely be a way to earn. And you can see you can earn up to twenty dollars per audio hour. That's per audio hour, not per hour you work because it will always take a little bit longer to actually do the transcription and how much you will earn will really depend on your skills. So at first, if you're new, then it will probably take some time, but eventually you can earn some quite decent money and you can find a lot of different work here. Another option is to use a platform like Fiverr, which is a freelance platform. And when it comes to data entry tasks, there are a lot of people looking on Fiverr for people to do data entry tasks. You can see some of the people selling data entry tasks now, for example, becoming a virtual assistant for web research or find email list addresses or data entry, all kind of work. You can see this person has been hired more than a thousand times. Also, this person has been hired more than a thousand times, this one 500 times. So you see there's a lot of people posting data entry jobs here, but some of them also get a lot of work. So if you take the time to build up your profile, you can do that at the same time as you use some of the other options, then this can potentially be a way to actually make a living if you become good at it and become good at or create a good reputation. And Fiverr is just one freelance platform like this you can use. You can also use other freelance platforms to have different profiles at the same time if you want that to increase your chances of getting data entry work. Another option is called One Space Freelancers. You can go to that section and you can see the current openings. They do not have that many freelance positions, but they come and go. This is kind of more an extra thing. You can see image and graphic designers right now or English and international language transcription. So it's kind of that type of job you can find. So it does not have that much diversity compared to many of the others, but the exact freelance position will vary from time to time. It can be an interesting platform to also keep an eye on for some extra work. The last option I want to go over is called to capture. And to be completely honest, I do actually not recommend doing capture work as a way to earn, even though it is very easy and you can very easily start with it. But I know many people have asked me about it and that's why I include it because this is one of the capture side that has existed for a very long time. So you can expect to actually earn here. But in general, you have to be careful when it comes to capture solving services or platforms because you do not know what the captures you are used for, it can in some cases even be misused. And also it takes an extreme amount of time and work to earn any money on capture sites in general. That's just something I, that personally, I therefore do not recommend, but I do know a lot of people ask about it. That's why I wanted to include one capture site on this list that I do know actually do work, even though it is for me an outsider, I would not recommend it for the reason I just explained. So overall, if you are looking for data entry tasks, there are plenty of platforms. And I have a full list also with full tutorials of all of these options and also joining links and also uh, information about even more options and other free ways to make money online. I will leave a link to that below so you can go there and see this full list if you're interested in any of these options. And then you can just uh, choose which options you want to get started with and join, create your profile and start earning more or less immediately depending on the method you choose. So I hope this video gave you some inspiration. A lot of people have asked about the best data entry tasks and for me to do an updated video about that. So I hope this video helped you. And if it did, then make sure to hit the like button. And also don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the notification bell so you won't miss out next time I release a video with tips and tricks about different ways to make some extra money on the side online.